All right, chance now to talk some more Madison Roller Derby with their brand new logo, their season going on. So much to talk about always as we bring in Tornado Alley right now. Thank Hello. you for joining us. Thank you. Yeah, nice to see you again. And let's talk about something um, that I think a lot of people don't know about when it comes yep. to roller derby in Madison, and that's Junior Roller Derby. Yes. Uh, yeah, this is even like the first I'm hearing of it today, so I, I'd love to know more about it. If you could please just explain oh away Junior Roller Derby. I am so excited about Junior Roller Derby. So um, there's been a big growth in, in the roller derby community recently, and a lot of that is coming from younger people wanting to learn how to skate and wanting to learn how to play roller derby, and we never had that. Um, Madison Roller Derby has always been um, 18 and older, mm -hmm. so all those younger kids really didn't have an opportunity to skate. We just started last weekend um, our junior roller derby program um, we only have one level it's for children ages 8 to 17 um, and right now it's just in the beginning phases and that kind of plays into the venue um, fundraising that we're trying to do right now we only have one hour for our junior derby skaters to skate oh, wow. so we only have we have very limited number of skaters we can have join us so we're really hoping to expand junior roller derby in the future and maybe eventually have a junior roller derby team yeah, so what, what the, the biggest thing is just getting that space of your yeah. own, isn't it? So, so what, what does Madison need? How, how, how could this work so that you can get more time and get Junior Roller Derby really going? Well, right now we rent time from Fast Forward, the skating rink here in town, and what we really need is more time. There's mm -hmm. only so many hours in the day, so many days of the week, and there's just not time to be able to hold all the practices necessary to train all those different levels of Junior Roller Derby and even for our own regular Madison Roller Derby. So what we really need is a home for ourselves to be dedicated to just roller derby so that we have all the time that we need to get all the practices in and make sure everybody's playing safely. That would be excellent. And yeah. so what I'm wondering too, I mean, you guys have such colorful nicknames. <laughs> I, I love the nicknames. I ask about them a lot. Does that apply to Junior Roller Derby too? Do they it get to does. choose it? It yeah. does. It does. So, uh, you know, they just started. So I don't know if any of them have their names picked out yet, but I've seen some very, very cute Junior Derby nicknames out in the world. So I'm super excited to see what the kids come up with. I'm guessing they, they stay away from the double entendres a little probably, bit, right? Yeah, yeah probably yeah. that's a good idea. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Very good idea. So let's talk about two uh, events coming up. Uh, yeah. So um, this spring, what do you got going on? Well, uh, we've got a regular home season. We've got three games left of that. Uh, Champs will be in May, so we've got that as well. Uh, we also have our Invitational Utter Chaos. Uh, that's coming up in April. We invite teams from all over the country to come in and play against our home teams, our travel team, and our uh, recreational team as well. Excellent stuff. Check them out all over social media, website, all that kind of good stuff. Tornado Alley, always love having you yes. on. Thanks for being Thank here. Thank you.